That's the note is, yeah. What's up? Um, this is weird because one is, uh, is that during reaction videos because tomorrow, throughout the week, throughout this month, I won't be doing any reactive videos, so this will be the only week y'all gonna get a good amount of videos out for this week because of school. That will be you know, discussed in, in a separate video, which is might be my fourth video for, I would say, tomorrow. You know, this will be uploaded today. The other three will be uploaded... Uh, the second video will be uploaded tomorrow, the third video will be uploaded Wednesday, third video will be uploaded, uploaded Thursday, and the fourth video will be uploaded Friday. Because I want Saturday and Sunday will be, I want to have like the best uh, weekend ever because one being me and my girlfriend's one month anniversary coming up in six days, so yeah. And other words, hey, I love my girlfriend so much. Uh, so right now, we'll be watching I Was Home Alone with my creepy uncle. When my parents said that my uncle Daniel was coming to stay Wait. with us for a while, I don't know how I felt about it. I come from a pretty... Hold on. My bad. Let me do that. When my parents said that my uncle Daniel was coming to stay with us for a while, I don't know how I felt about it. I come from a pretty wealthy family, and I'd say I have a pretty good life. I'm 15. My name's Desiree, by the way, and I have loads of great friends in my high school. Uh, I got great friends online. <laughs> no joke. Uh, if you see some, like, you know, scrolling, it's my latest subscriber. It's an X7 updates. Go to scratch that dude, I think. Um, he's a hardworking person. He has a, also has a channel that does updates on the entertainment uh, industry. So, yeah. I think while you're watching this, I'm live on Twitch. So that my Twitch thing being does the in the description below so click the link because uh, I'll be chatting with you guys in, in the chat room because uh, yeah just, just come join and yeah the only major downfall is that my parents are super strict as in I need to study eight hours a day no boys are allowed in our house and I'm not even allowed to have my best girlfriends over wow that's actually strict God. Damn! God damn, bruh. So, it gets pretty lonely at home. And now to- To me, it, it does, like, hey. Cause like, to be honest, like, look. Yes, today is the one year anniversary of when Luke Paul explained everything what happened days ago. At the UK press conference, so yeah. To top it off, my weird uncle was staying with us, and that made me feel super uncomfortable. One weekend, I was studying in the garden by the pool. I was wearing a bikini because it was crazy hot. I suddenly had this feeling that- Bruh, bruh. LA! <laughs> that I was being watched. Sure enough, when I turned around, there was my uncle Daniel, standing by the window with a drink in his hand, smiling at me that's creepy that's that's a non uh it, it, hey excuse my language but non shit all right <laughs> why was he so creepy i quickly grabbed my towel and wrapped it around myself when i came back into the house to get some water he looked at me licked his lips and said oh my desiree you've grown up to be quite the stunner haven't you yeah. What the hell, bruh? What the bruh? That bruh.
Bruh. That's... What? That's weird. That's... That's creepy, bruh. That's literally creepy. Fuck. What was his problem? Later that day, I told my parents that he made me feel uncomfortable, and I told them what he'd said to me, and they just laughed and said he was just complimenting me, and that it was true. I what the? No, it isn't. That's literally. That's literally. Like, what? Bruh. By the way, if you're wondering, uh, why aren't you doing school? Like, your, your brother and your mom will be saying, oh, do your schoolwork. Bruh. Bruh, my mom, my brother knows that today, that while I'm recording this, it's Columbus Day, meaning my last day of my week off, I mean, my almost week, my one and a half week off from school. So hey, I like having like a fall break, cause yeah, but hey, I don't know if it's true, but. There might be a, it takes me a break. Just say it because we had what in ninth grade. I just remember it. We had Thanksgiving break in November last year. Just saying, if we do, we're gonna do plenty of content, Twitch, and YouTube. And on Instagram as well. <laughs> Which I need to do also, like, uh,. A Instagram, uh, you know, stuff as well, so yeah. I was a pretty girl. And then, the next day, my parents left for a holiday to Spain. <clears throat> yep, my Uncle Daniel was looking after me. Oh, it was oh. like my worst nightmare came true. As soon as they left, he looked at me and winked and said, It's just you and me, girl. What mischief are we going to get up to? What the f- Oh my gosh. Sorry, I have to adjust my camera. Like, what the f dude? That dude's a freaking pedo, bruh! Sorry, I'd say, but this person is a f pedo. Later that night, I was hiding in my bedroom doing homework when I heard another man's voice in the house. My uncle had obviously invited a friend over. I turned my music down and crept to the top of the stairs to eavesdrop. They were laughing, and then I heard my name. Desiree would make us a pretty penny, that's for sure. Were they talking about selling me? Surely I misheard. I ran back to my room, my heart thumping in my chest. I was so hungry, but there was no way I was going downstairs now. I felt scared in my own home. Oh, fuck. This was ridiculous. No oh, fuck. I went to sleep and had a whole bunch of nightmares. I woke up at one point soaked in sweat and could have sworn there was a man in my room going through my cupboard. It looked like he was filling a bag with clothes. Were we being robbed? I felt delirious and realized it must have been a nightmare. So I closed my eyes and went back to sleep. But then I woke up the next day and I wasn't in my room. I could barely see because the room I was in was dark. I looked down at myself and almost screamed. My hands were tied behind my back, and I was wearing red leather lingerie. There was no one else around, but suddenly I saw someone turn a light on outside the room I was in. The light filtered in, enough for me to figure out how to untie my hands. Good. My bag of clothes the man had packed were by my feet, and I almost wanted to thank God. I kept a spare phone in the ins- Hey, That's a good idea! Having a spare phone? Just to call up the cops, say, yo, uh, there's this random mm, people in my house robbing me and doing weird to me. Come on, dude. That, that's good. Inside pocket, as that was my bag for school trips. My Ooh, my god. Your bag for school trips? Bruh, that's such a genius idea. Hey. Parents had bought it for me in case of emergencies. And this was definitely an emergency. Bruh, that's good. That's good that your parents bought you a spare phone for only for emergencies, but you used it for emergency. That's good. Hey. I quickly reached for the bag and dialed 911. I used the GPS to track where I was and quickly told the operator, but suddenly the door opened. 
I let the phone drop, but I didn't hang up. Uncle Daniel and his friend were standing there, grinning, and I peered into the room behind them. There were dozens of girls tied up, and some of them even had their mouths taped shut. My uncle was rubbing his hands together, looking like he'd just won the lottery. I shut my eyes and pretended to be asleep and prayed and prayed that the police would turn up. My uncle's friend came over to me and said, Wake up. Smile for the camera. What do you think of your lingerie? I'm sure they will love it. You're going to make us rich, sweetie. I was seriously ready to scream when I heard frantic footsteps above me. Suddenly, three cops were bashing open the Let's door to go. the basement and running down. I cried with relief. My uncle and his friend were arrested and sentenced to 10 years in prison. I don't think that's enough for what they planned to do to me and all those other innocent young girls. One of the girls told us what they'd been planning. To sell us to an illegal establishment. They'd act as our pimps and take 50% of whatever we made. Bro, that's some, uh, like, anxiety type shit, bro. <laughs> Sorry for, you know, the Jake Pollock, but it's true. Izadi is a pimp, alright? 100% a pimp. That's why Jake was blindly saying, Oh, let me, um, grab Izadi and, bruh, Izadi a, a good look for Jake Paul, the name. Her Jake Paul himself. Since then, he has been out of that life. He's out of the life, which is good. So hey, and by the way, he he's under a new agency, I think, which is SOT. So shout out to that. So hey, shout out. Which by the way, he could, you know, like train whenever he like. By the way, he's still sober. All right. J Paul sober because if he were to drink, bruh, that 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 that'll pretty much like wreck the training camp. Plus the 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 fight with Nate Robson is in a couple of weeks, ladies and gentlemen. Literally next month. Next month, November twenty-eighth. My gosh. I don't understand how they could have thought they'd get away with this. Of course, me and my parents moved to a new house. I feel safer knowing he can't find us when he gets out. But I just wish my parents had taken me seriously when I told them he made me uncomfortable. I guess you never know what people's intentions are. But chances are, if you feel unsafe, it's because something isn't right. I hate to imagine what could have happened to us if the cops hadn't saved us in time. Same. Same. <laughs> so yeah, uh Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hit the like button down below. Subscribe if you're new. Give me to two hundred subscribers this month. I'm trying to beat uh Skull Gamer Skull Dragon Gamer. Um So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hit the like button down below, subscribe if you're new, turn on post notifications, turn on post notifications, turn on your post notifications on to all, cause I don't want y'all to miss any videos this week, cause, uh, yeah, for the video will be out this Friday about, which I'll be recording today, but the first video will be out Friday, like, uh, the, the whole reason why, like, like, like a long video and even uh an update if if this youtuber named Bing Jam will upload videos again. <laughs> so yeah, uh with that that'd be my fifth video actually. Two videos on Friday. So you get an extra video on Friday as well, so yeah. So yeah. Take care everyone and peace. Now fuck out people. See ya.